the World Health Organization is facing a potential shakeup aimed at preventing future outbreaks from destroying lives and livelihoods. Health ministers agreed to study recommendations for ambitious reforms made by independent experts to strengthen the capacity of both the UN agency and countries to contain new pathogens under the resolution submitted by the European Union and adopted by consensus, member states are to be firmly in the driver's seat of the reforms through a year-long process. The new virus has infected more than 170 million people and killed nearly 3.7 million, according to a Reuters tally of official national figures. We've seen with Ebola, we've seen with other diseases, they, they can amplify and spread in our communities and our healthcare facilities, unknown, unseen and undetected, until they then spread within countries and between countries, endangering all of humanity. They can kill us and disrupt every aspect of our lives. They exploit our interconnectedness, they expose uh, our lack of coordination, our lack of solidarity, uh, our societal inequities. In short, uh, the pathogens are, are winning this fight right now uh, and that should not be uh, the status quo and it should not be something we accept and therefore we really do welcome the recommendations of uh, within the resolutions and, and also the proposed decision to take this forward to an international agreement or framework convention on preparedness and, and response to for pandemics hello Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.